June 17th, 2020. Mr. Clerk, will you please call the roll? Kelly. Here. Bishop. Frank Kelly. Here. She's on mute. Cleveland. Here. Conwell. Griffin. Here. Harrison. Here. Johnson. He's here. Johnson's here. Uh, Bushier Jones. Here. Jo uh, Joseph Jones. Casey. Here. McCormick. Present. Mooney. Valencic. Santana. Present. Dwight. Present. Zone. Mr. Chairman, you have a quorum. Thank you very much. What is our number, Mr. Clerk? 11. Okay. So before we go to any second reading, we're going to need at least 12. But at this point, I would like everybody uh, to. First reading, anything passed, we, we need 12. So first reading for passage. Uh, Joseph Jones is just checking in, and Clancy has checked in. Okay. So at this point, I would ask everybody to please pause for a moment of silence, followed by the Pledge of Allegiance. Thank you. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay. This council meeting is being held during the COVID-19 emergency declaration and is being conducted as a virtual meeting in accordance with Ohio's open meetings law as amended by sub House Bill 197. Notice was publicly posted. In compliance with the Charter and Rules of Council, a copy of all legislation to be heard during this council meeting was furnished previously to, previous to the meeting to every council member through their council email. It is hereby acknowledged without objection that all council members have received the legislation. Mr. Clerk, will you please dispense with the journal? Council Member Santana, that the reading of the, of the minutes for the last meeting be dispensed with and, and the journal approved. Second by Councilman uh, McCormick. Thank you. Communications. File number 518-2020 from Council President Kelly, designating Alan Dreyer, Clerk of Council Pro Tem for all matters requiring the clerk's signature on June 17, 2020. 520-2020 from the Cuyahoga County Board of Elections, certificate of results of the election on issue five, proposed charter amendment from the March 17th April 28th extended primary election. I found number 521-2020 from Cuyahoga County Board of Elections. C certificate of results of the election on issue six, proposed charter amendment from the March 17th, April 28th extended primary election. Found number 522-2020 from Cuyahoga County Board of Elections. Certificate of results of the election on issue seven, proposed charter amendment from the March 17th, 2020, April 28th extended primary election. Thank you. First reading emergency ordinances to be referred for administrative and committee review. Ordinance number 498-2020 by Council Member Kelly, an emergency ordinance confirming the authority of the Cleveland Panther Garden to charge admission fees and parking fees and to erect improvements on property lease or sublease to the Cleveland Botanical Garden and authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into a fourth supplement indenture of the lease agreement. Ordinance number 499-2020 by Council Members Cleveland, Johnson, Brancatelli, and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance to amend the title on section 18 of ordinance number 588-17 passed June 5th, 2017, re relating to giving consent to the Director of Transportation of the State of Ohio, remove and replace existing East 75th Street Bridge to supplement the ordinance by adding new section 7A, 7B, 7D, 7D, and 17A to add the authority to apply and accept additional funding and to cause payment to the state for the city's share of the improvement. Ordinance number 500-2020 by Council Members Griffin, Johnson, Brancatelli, and Kelly by departmental request. 
an emergency ordinance authorizing the mayor to apply to the District 1 Public Works Integrated Committee for state funding for the rehabilitation of a portion of Buckeye Road to accept such funding, to apply for and accept gifts and grants from various entities for the improvement, authorizing the director of capital projects to enter into contracts and agreements to design and construct the improvement and other agreements, and authorizing the commissioner purchases and supplies to acquire, accept, and record for right-of-way purposes real property and easements necessary to make the improvement. Ordinance number 501-2020 by Council Members Bishop Cleveland, Griffin, Johnson, Brent, Kelly, and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance giving consent to the City of Cleveland to the Director of Transportation of the State of Ohio for improving Union Avenue from Broadway Avenue to Kensington Road to apply for and accept any gifts or grants from any public or private entity, authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to enter into any relative agreements and causing payment of the city's share to the state for the cost of the improvement. Ordinance number 502-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Johnson, Brent, Kelly, and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance giving consent to the City of Cleveland to the Director of Transportation to the of, of State of Ohio for resurfacing a portion of West 14th Street to apply for and accept any gifts or grants from any public or private entity, authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to enter into any relative agreements and cause the payment of the city's share to the state for the cost of the improvement. Ordinance number 506-2020 by Council Members Brent, Kelly, and Kelly by departmental request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the director of city planning to enter into an amendment to contract number PS2019-138 with Code Studio Inc. to extend the term of the contract up to one year and to add additional services for form based zoning title initiative. Ordinance number 507 2020 by Council Member Bashir Jones, Director Kelly and Kelly, by departmental request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the director of economic development to enter into to enter into a tax increment finance agreement with Inspiring Group Limited or its designee to provide for the developer to make certain improvements to provide for payments to the Cleveland Metropolitan School District and to declare certain improvements to real property to be a public token. Or ordinance number 508 2020 by Council Member McCormick, Brent Kelly, and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Economic Development to enter into a tax increment finance agreement with Sustainable Community Associates. Or its designate to provide for the developer to make certain improvements to the Lincoln Building Project, provide for payments to the Cleveland Metropolitan School District, and to declare certain improvements to real property to be a public project. Ordinance number 510 2020 by Council Members Cleveland and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Port Control to exercise the second option to renew contract number PS 2018 188 with ARINC Inc to provide maintenance, operation, and management services for city-owned common use facilities at Cleveland Hawkins International Airport. Ordinance number 511-2020 by Council Members Cleveland and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Port Control to exercise the first option to renew contract number LS2018-23 with Southwest Airlines Company to lease cargo space at building number 216 at South Park Facility of Cleveland Hawkins International Airport. Ordinance number 513-2020 by Council Members Cleveland and Kelly by Department of Press. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Port Control to employ one or more professional consultants to develop a master plan update for Burke Lakefront Airport. Ordinance number 514-2020 by Council Members Cleveland and Kelly by Department of Press. Emergency ordinance authorizing the purchase by one or more retirement contracts of asphalt for runways, taxiways, ramps, and roadways, including labor and materials for repair and installation if necessary for the various divisions of the, part, of the Department of Port Control for a period of two years with two one-year options to renew, the first of which is exercisable through additional legislative authority. Ordinance number 515-2020 by Council Member Zone and Kelly by Department of Press. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Safety to enter into a memorandum of understanding with the United States <coughs> Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms, and Explosives, and the Ohio County Prosecutor's Office collaborate on the collection, management, and analysis of, gun, of crime gun data, and to authorize the acceptance of asset forfeiture proceeds and other funds for the reimbursement of Cleveland Police Officer salaries and or overtime. Ordinance number 516-2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by, by departmental request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the purchase by one or more requirement contracts of labor and materials to paint poles and other street side elements in the division of Cleveland Public Power Department of Public Utilities for a period of two years. That's all for that section. Thank you, Mr. Clerk. First reading emergency ordinances to be passed.
Ordinance number 491-2020 by Council Members Bishop, McCormick, Cleveland, Griffin, Brent, Kelly, Zoning, Slight. An emergency ordinance amending the title on section one of ordinance number 736-2019, past June 3rd, 2019, as it pertains to authorizing the director of the Department of Community Development to enter into agreement with Cleveland Public Theater for the student theater enrichment programs on a step to the use of wards 2, 3, 5, 6, 12, 15, and 17 as casino revenue funds. Ordinance number 492-2020 by Council Member Griffin, emergency ordinance amending section one of ordinance number 827. 2019 passed July 24, 2019, as it pertains to authorizing the director of the Department of Community Development to enter into an agreement with the Fairfax Renaissance Development Corporation for the Healthy Community Engagement Program through the use of Ward 6 Casino Revenue Funds. Ordinance number 493 2020 by Councilmember McCormick, an emergency ordinance authorizing the director of the Department of Community Development to enter into agreement with the Fremont West Development Corporation for the Arts in August Expo for the use of Ward 3 Casino Revenue Funds. Ordinance number 494-2020 by Council Members Joseph Jones, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Valencia, Conroe, and Hairston. An emergency ordinance amending Section 2 of Ordinance number 1436-2019, passed November 18, 2019, as it pertains to authorizing the draft of community development to enter into agreement with the Nikos Foundation for the Needy Family and Senior Food Card Program Distribution Program. <coughs> Through the use of awards one, four, seven, eight, nine, and ten casino revenue funds. Ordinance number 495 2020 by Council Member Santana, an emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of the Department of Community Development to enter into agreement with the Near West Side Multi Service Corporation, DBA, May Dugan Center, for the Refugee Social Service Support Program through the use of Ward 14 casino revenue funds. Ordinance number 496 2020 by Council Member Cleveland and Bashir Jones. An emergency ordinance authorizing the director of the Department of Community Development to enter into agreement with Midtown Cleveland Inc. for the, for, for the Pow Wow Educational Expo through the use of wards five and seven to see revenue funds. Ordinance number 497 2020 by Council Member Conwell, an emergency ordinance authorizing the director of the Department of Community Development to enter into agreement with the National Kidney Foundation for the 2020 virtual kidney walk through the use of ward nine to see revenue funds. Ordinance number 509-2020 by Council Member Kelly by Department of Defense. An emergency ordinance affirming the funds from the, from the county coronavirus relief distribution fund will be expended only to cover costs in the city of Cleveland, Ohio, consistent with the requirements of section 5001 of the CARES Act as described in 42 USC 801D and any applicable regulations as is necessary pursuant to House Bill 41 for receiving said funds and declaring an emergency. Ordinance number 512-2020 uh, by Council Members Cleveland Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance determining the method of making the public improvement of rehabilitating and repairing runway 6R-24L at Cleveland Hopkins International Airport and authorizing the director for control to enter into one or more public improvement contracts for the making of the improvement. That's all, Council President. Thank you. Need the motion to suspend the rules. All right. By Council Member Santana, that the rules be suspended and the legislation just read in place on final passage. Second by Council Member McCormick. Please call the roll. Kelly, Bishop, Frank Daly, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Hairston, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Jay Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Blanchett, Santana, Sly, Zoe. I heard no nays, Mr. Chairman. So, uh, so there's 17 days. Thank you. Please call the roll on passage. Kelly, Bishop, Frank Kelly, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Hairston, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joe Jones, A.G. McCormick, Moody, Valencia, Santana, Slide, Zone. 17 days. Thank you. First reading emergency resolution to be referred for administrative and committee review. Uh, resolution number 503-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Johnson, and Frank Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency resolution declaring the intent to vacate a portion of Japan Court Southwest. Resolution number 505-2020 by Council Members Zone, Frank Kelly, and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency resolution approving the continuation and expansion of the Gordon Square Arts District, Cleveland Improvement District, as a special improvement district in the city, accepting petitions from owners of property in the district 
approving a new plan for public services, declaring it necessary to provide maintenance, security, marketing, and other services for the district, and providing for the assessment of the cost of such work upon benefited property in the, in the, in the district and declaring an emergency. That's all for the resolutions. Thank you. First reading emergency resolutions to be adopted. Resolution number 519-2020 by Councilmember Kelly, an emergency resolution fixing the date of the next regular meeting of the council of July 1st, 2020. Read the motion to suspend the rules. M motion by Councilmember Santana that the rules be suspended and the legislation just, rest, just read be placed on final passage. Seconded by Councilmember McCormick. Please call the roll. Kelly, Bishop, Frank Kelly, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Harrison, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joe Jones, Daisy McCormick, Mooney, Valencia, Santana, Slife, Zone. 17 days. Please call the roll on adoption. Kelly, Bishop, Frank Kelly, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Harrison, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Valencia, Santana, Slife, Zone. 17 days. 16. Thank you. Second reading ordinances to be passed. Ordinance number 411 2019 as amended by Councilmember Griffin. An emergency ordinance establishing a moratorium on the review and issuance of zoning permits. Certificates of occupancy and other license or permit applications, small box discount stores. Ordinance number 25 2020 by Council Members McCormick, Cleveland, Bashir Jones, Johnson, Brent Kelly, and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance to amend sections 508.03 and 508.04 of the codified ordinance of the Cleveland, Ohio, 1976, as amended by various ordinances relating to the application for permits and permit fee and duration for temporary sidewalk occupancy permits vending devices in the central business district. Ordinance number 255-2020, Council Members Johnson, Harrison, and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into one or more contracts with City Year to perform community service work and to collaborate with various nonprofit agencies. Ordinance number 26-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Johnson, and Frank Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to issue a permit to the United States of America to approach into the public right of way of East 6th Street by installing, using, and maintaining 12 security bollards. Ordinance number 257 2020 by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by departmental request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into one or more contracts with Case Western Reserve University to provide a youth, summer sports, nutrition, health, and life skills development program for 2020 under the National Youth Sports Program sponsored by Case Western Reserve University. Ordinance number 258-2020 by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by Department of West. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into an agreement with the Neighbor Leadership Institute to implement educational, recreational, and cultural programs in various school buildings and recreation facilities during evening hours, provide leadership training, and oversee the summer tennis program. Ordinance number 261-2020 as amended. Council Members Blancet, Casey, and Kelly by Department of West. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Utilities to renew the lease with City Road Limited for certain property at 743 East 145th Street, East 140th Street, Cleveland, Ohio, for a term of two years with a two-year option to renew, exercisable by the Director of Public Utilities for the public purpose of operating the division of Cleveland Public Power's East Side Service Center at 745 East 140th Street. <laughs> With the motion to suspend the rules? No, we're, we have more. Oh, I'm sorry. Ordinance number 286 as amended by Council Members McCormick, Frank Kelly, and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Economic Development to enter into a tax increment financing agreement with the Sherwood Williams Company or its designee to provide assistance to fund the construction of the new global headquarters to be, glo to, to be located at Public Square West and the corner of Superior Avenue and West 6th Street, to provide for payments to the Cleveland Metropolitan School District and to declare certain improvements to rural property to be a public purpose. Ordinance number 317-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Johnson, and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to enter into one or more agreements to the Northeast Ohio Regional Sewer District regarding road, drainage, and sewer improvements on, the, on Literary Road 
from University Road to West Search Street under their combined sewer overflow project, authorizing any agreement necessary to complete the work and to cause payment of the city's share of the improvement. Ordinance number 318-2020 by Council Members Harrison, Conwell, Johnson, and Kelly by Department of the Public. An emergency ordinance giving consent of the City of Cleveland to the County of Cuyahoga for the rehabilitation of the St. Clair Avenue Bridge over Dome Brook in the City of Cleveland, authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to enter into two agreements and to apply for and accept an allocation of County Motor Vehicle License Tax Fund funds. Ordinance number 319-2020 by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by Department of the West. Emergency ordinance giving consent to the city of Cleveland to the, to the Ohio Department of Transportation to upgrade guardrail and treatments at various locations and authorizing other agreements. Ordinance number 338-2020 by Council Members Johnson, Frank and Kelly by Department of West. Emergency ordinance to amend the title in sections one and three of ordinance number 1532-2019, past 20, past December 2nd, 2019, relating to authority to enter into maintenance, inspection, and repair agreement to issue an encroachment, an encroachment permit to encroach into the public right of way of Ontario Street with an overhead bridge and two pre and two precast connecting portals. Ordinance number 349 as amended by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into a contract with Zscape LLC for citywide tree planting for a period of one year as a continuation of contract number MARC. 2018-102. Ordinance number 352-2020 by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by the Department of West. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Works to enter into one or more concession agreements for the operation of a first class food and beverage service for the City Hall cafeteria and in connection with, with renting the rotunda in City Hall and for marketing and rental of the rotunda for catered events for a period not to exceed three years with two one-year options to renew exercisable by the Director of Public Works. Ordinance number 353-2020 by Council Member Slight, Johnson, and Brancatelli by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance giving consent of the City of Cleveland to the County of Cuyahoga for the improvement of peer repair on the West 150th Street Bridge, authorizing the Director of Capital Projects to enter into agreements to apply for and accept an allocation of County Motor Vehicle License Tax Funds. Ordinance number 354-2020 by Council Members Cleveland, Johnson, and Brancatelli by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance giving consent to the city of Cleveland to the Director of Transportation of the State of Ohio to construct the improvement at Kingsman Road and East 55th Street intersection to authorize one or more agreements necessary to make the improvement. Ordinance number 355-2020 by Council Members Griffin, Johnson, and Brent Kelly by Departmental Request. An emergency ordinance giving consent to the city of Cleveland, giving consent of the city of Cleveland to, to, the, to the Director of Transportation of the State of Ohio to construct the improvement at Kinsman Road and East 93rd Street intersection and to authorize one or more agreements necessary to make the improvement. Ordinance number 365-2020 by Council Members Cleveland, Johnson, and Brent Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance giving consent of the City of Cleveland to the Director of Transportation of the State of Ohio to construct the improvement at the Orange Avenue with I-77 Grant and East 30th Street intersection and to authorize one or more agreements necessary to make the improvement. Ordinance number 370-2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Utilities to enter into one or more contracts with ITRON Incorporated for professional services necessary to provide automatic media reading services, including but not limited to acquiring licenses and recommending integrating and installing upgrades to the existing system and providing hardware and software maintenance, and to enter into contracts for the various written standard purchase and requirement contracts with ITRON for the purchase of meters and related equipment and services and labor and materials to provide modifications to existing equipment for a period of two years with a one-year option to renew exercisable by, by additional legislative authority. For this number 370. question. Yes. A quick procedural question is I don't think we for the non-emergency ordinances, I don't think we we called the rule on those. I think we rolled right into from ordinances to emergency ordinances. Is there any prohibition that would have us? No, these are all emergency or I might not have said it, but it, but these are all emergency ordinances. Okay, so these are all second reading emergency ordinances. Yes. Okay, thank you. Please continue. Ordinance number 372 2020 by council members Casey and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance determining the method of making the public improvement 
creating and installing building identification signs at up to 12 water treatment plants and various multi-building secondary sites, and authorizing the director of public utilities to enter into one or more public movement contracts for the making of the improvement. Ordinance number 373-2020 by Council Members Johnson and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the director of public works to employ one or more professional consultants to provide security services at various indoor and outdoor recreation facilities, including but not limited to recreation centers, outdoor pools, and various surrounding play areas for a period not to exceed one year. Ordinance number 376-2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by departmental request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the purchase by one or more requirement contracts of various types of electrical test equipment and labor and materials necessary to maintain and repair electrical test equipment, including training when necessary, the revision of paying public power department of public utilities for a period of two years with two one year options to renew, the first of which is, is exercisable by additional legislative authority. Ordinance number 377 2020 by Council Members Conwell, Johnson, Franca Kelly, and Kelly by Department of Request. Authorizing the Director of Public Works to execute ease of easement uh, granting to, to East Ohio Gas Company doing business with Dominion Energy Ohio. Certain easement rights and property located in Rockefeller Park along East Boulevard near East 105th Street and declaring that the easement rights granted are not needed for public fee. Ernest number 447-2020 by Council Member Frank Kelly uh, and Kelly by Department of Health. The emergency ordinance to amend sections one and three of ordinance number 176 2020 passed February 24, 2020, relating to grants from the United States Department of Housing and Urban Development for, for the program year and under Title I of the Housing and Community Development Act of 1974 for the 2020 Federal Home Investment Partnerships Act program, the Emergency Solutions Grant Program, and the Housing Opportunities for Persons with AIDS program. Emergency number 448-2020 by Council Members Frank Kelly and Kelly by Department of Office. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Community Development to exercise the second option to renew contract number CT8006 PS2018-129 Cyber Ridge LLC to implement a loan servicing committee and community development tracking reporting system. <coughs> ordinance number 449-2020 by Council Members Frank Kelly and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Community Development to administer the Community Engagement Healthy Home Initiative to enter into one of our contracts with various community development corporations for the purpose of hiring community engagement specialists by neighborhood to improve the quality of life for residents and the city's housing stock, to enter into professional service contracts for acquisition of software and training to conduct the initiative, and to make purchases of materials, equipment, supplies, and services needed to conduct the initiative. Ordinance number 459-2020 by Council Members Griffin and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Health to accept a grant from the Ohio Environmental Protection Agency for the 2021 financial assistance for the operation of the Division of Air Quality, authorizing the Director to enter into one or more contracts with various services, equipment, supplies, and contracts with various agencies or entities necessary to operate the Division of Air Quality, determining the method of constructing, rehabilitating, renovating, replacing, or otherwise improving air monitoring sites and other similar structures on city-owned and city use property, and authorizing the director to enter into one or contracts to construct an improvement and design. Ordinance number 460-2020, and my council member for Sheer Jones, Frank Kelly and Kelly, by department of request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the mayor and the commission of purchases by requiring reconvey properties presently owned by the Instagram Group Limited, or its designee, located at 3101 Newport Avenue for the purpose of entering into the chain of title prior to the adoption of tax increment finance legislation authorized under section 5709.41 of the revised code. Ordinance number 463-2020 as amended by Council Member McCormick, Frank Kelly and Kelly by Department of Request. The emergency ordinance authorizing the mayor and the commissioner of purchases and supplies require and reconvey properties presently owned by sustainable community associates for its designate located at 2410 Scranton Road for the purpose of entering into the chain of title prior to the adoption of the tax increment finance legislation authorized under section 5709.41 of the revised code. Ordinance number 464-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Frank Kelly and Kelly for Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing Director of Economic Development to enter into contract with Sustainable Community Associates or ZME to provide economic development assistance to support the development of the linking building project and other associated costs necessary to redevelop the property. Ordinance number 478-2020 by Council Member Griffin and Kelly by Department of Request. 
uh, an, an emergency ordinance authorizing the director of public health to enter into one or more contracts with the Center on Urban Poverty and Community Development at Case Western Reserve University to provide evaluation services for the Moms First program for a period of one year. Ordinance number 479 2020 by Council Members Griffin and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the director of public health to enter into one or more contracts with Ronald K. White doing business as a transparency program to continue to provide fatherhood services to participants in the Moms First program for a period of one year. Ordinance number 480-2020 by Council Members Griffin and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the purchase by one or more apartment contracts of indigent cremations of deceased residents of the Division of Health Department of Public Health for a term of two years with two one-year options to renew exercisable by the Director of Public Health. Ordinance number 482-2020 by Council Member Zoning Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Safety to enter into an agreement with the Cuyahoga County Solid Waste District with the funding and support of the Department of Public Safety's Environmental Crimes Task Force for purposes including but not limited to the purchase of equipment, clothing, and for overtime necessary to assist in combating the legal dumping. Ordinance number 43 2020 by Councilmember Zoning Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance to amend section 393.05 of the codified ordinances of Cleveland, Ohio, 1976, as amended by ordinance number 2704 B 83 passed March 4th, 1985, relating to hazard determination and communication program. Ordinance number 44 2020 by Councilmember Zoning Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Safety to apply for an accepted grant from the Ohio Office of Criminal Justice Services for the fiscal year 19 State Bird Memorial Justice Assistance Grant for the operation of the Northern Ohio Law Enforcement Task Force and authorizing the director to enter into agreements with various municipalities or governmental agencies needed to implement the grant. Ordinance number 46 2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the director of public utilities to enter into one or more agreements with the Northeast Ohio Regional Sewer District. To replace a water main in Rexville Road on the Chippewa Creek, Creek in the city of Rexville and the design of the main replacement and to provide a prepayment or reimburse them for the city's share of the improvement. Ordinance number 47 2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Utilities to enter into one or more contracts with, with, without competitive bidding with Thermo Electron North America, North American LLC, a part of Thermo Fisher Scientific. For the purpose of items and services required to convert the existing liquid chrom 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 chromatograph into a tandem mass spectrometer, including software and other necessary appurtenances, training and maintenance, for a period of three years, for two one year options to renew the maintenance exercisable by the Director of Public Utilities. Ordinance number 488 2020 by Council Members Casey and Kelly by Department and Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Utilities to exercise the first option to renew contract number CT NF. 2019-2, the Pinky Enterprise LLC, doing businesses take a break, quick catering to provide a first class food and beverage, beverage service to the Carl B. Stokes facility. Ordinance number 489 2020 by Council Member Stacey and Kelly by Department of Request. Emergency ordinance authorizing direct health employees to enter into one or more agreements with CHN Housing Partners to, to administer energy, water, and sewer conservation services to low income homeowners, other business of water. Water Pollution Control and Clean Public Power Department of Public Utilities for a period of one year, one year option to renew, exercisable by the Director of Public Utilities. Ordinance number 490 2020 by Council Member Stacey and Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency ordinance authorizing the Director of Public Utilities to enter into a utilities repair agreement with the County of Cuyahoga to pay or reimburse directly related costs incurred by the County for the repair of storm and sanitary sewer lines on an as needed, on an as -needed basis. For a period not to exceed two years, with one option to renew for an additional one year period, it's exercisable by the Director of Public Utilities. That's all for that section. You sure? I'm sure. Okay, thanks. Um, read the motion to suspend the rules. By Council Member Santana, that the rules be, be suspended and the legislation is read and placed in final passage, seconded by Council Member McCormick. Please call the roll. Kelly, Bishop, Francatelli, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Hairston, uh, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Valencic, Santana, Slife, Zone. 16 yes, Mr. Jim. Please call the roll on passage. Kelly, Bishop, Francatelli, Cleveland, Conwell, 
Griffin, Hairston, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Valancic, Cantana, Sly, no, 16 years. Thank you. Now I would like to, before we move to the next section, um, I want to um, flag uh, Councilman Bashir Jones wish to vote no on three ordinances. Is that correct, Councilman? The safety pieces? Yes, that is, that is, that is correct, Mr. President. Thank you. So the correct count should be 16-0 for all of them except for the three safety pieces. The numbers escape me right now, but if um, if we could record those no votes, I'd appreciate it. Thank you, sir. Uh, Councilman Jones, we'll, we'll follow up with you to make sure we get the vote right. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you, sir. Thank you. Second reading emergency resolutions to be adopted. Um, right now we're on second reading non-emergency ordinances. Okay, I've got them backwards on my cheat sheet. Second reading ordinances to be passed. Ordinance number 206-2020 by Council Member Griffin, an ordinance changing the use area and height districts of parcels of land west of Mapleside Road to east of Baldwin Road as identified on the attached map, map change number 2608. Read the motion to suspend the rules. A uh, motion by Councilmember Santana that the rules be suspended and the legislation just read be placed on final passage. Second by Councilmember McCormick. Please call the roll. Kelly, Bishop, Brancatelli, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Harrison, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Valencic, Santana, Slight, Zone. 17 yes, Mr. Chairman. Please call the roll on passage. Kelly, Bishop, Frank Kelly, Cleveland, Conma, Griffin, Harrison, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey, McCormick, Mooney, Valencic, Santana, Slight, Zone, 17 days. Thank you. Second reading emergency resolutions to be adopted. Resolution number 254-2020 by Council Members McCormick, Johnson, and Frank Kelly by Department of Request. An emergency resolution declaring the intent to vacate a portion of Gilbert Avenue. Read the motion to suspend the rules. Motion by Council Member Santana that the rules be suspended and the legislation just read be placed in final passage. Second by Council Member McCormick. Please call the roll. Kelly, Bishop, Brancatelli, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Harrison, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey McCormick, Mooney, Valencic, Santana, Slight, and Zone. 17 days, Mr. Chairman. Please call the roll on adoption. Kelly, Bishop, Brancatelli, Cleveland, Conwell, Griffin, Hairston, Johnson, Bashir Jones, Joseph Jones, Casey McCormick, Mooney, Valencic, Santana, Slife, Zone. 17 yes, Mr. Chairman. Thank you. Uh, there are no absences to excuse. Our next regular meeting of council will be on Wednesday, July 1st, immediately following Committee of the Whole, which will begin at 10 a.m. Council is adjourned to the call of the chair. Thank you all very much for your participation and your uh, being here with us today. Thank you so much. I had a gavel, I'd hit it. <laughs>